For centuries, humanity has dreamed of creation, of breathing life into the inanimate. But what happens when our creations gain a will of their own? Or worse, when we lose control? Deep within ancient Jewish folklore lies the tale of the golem, a being of clay brought to life not by divine spark, but by human hand. In 16th century Prague, Rabbi Lowe, seeking to protect his community from persecution, molded a giant figure from the Vltava riverbed. Through mystical incantations and the insertion of a sacred word, the Shem, into its mouth or forehead, the golem awoke. It was a silent, obedient servant, a protector of the innocent. But the golem, though powerful, lacked true understanding. It knew no nuance, no mercy. Its strength, once a shield, became a blunt instrument. Legends tell of the golem growing too powerful, too destructive, its protective instincts turning into uncontrolled rampages. The very creator who brought it to life eventually had to dismantle it, removing the Shem to return it to inert clay. The lesson was stark. Creation without full comprehension of its consequences can lead to disaster. Fast forward to today. We are building our own golems, not of clay, but of code artificial intelligence. We imbue these systems with vast knowledge, incredible processing power, and the ability to learn. Like the golem, they are designed to serve, to protect, to optimize. But are we truly in control? Consider this. As AI becomes more autonomous, how do we ensure its actions align with our complex human values, not just its programmed objectives? What happens when an AI designed for efficiency, makes decisions that are logically sound but ethically questionable from a human perspective. Are we creating tools we can always unplug, or are we heading towards a point of no return, where the sham of control becomes elusive? The Gollum story isn't just a myth, it's a timeless warning, a reflection on the profound responsibility that comes with the power of creation. As we push the boundaries of AI, Perhaps we should remember the clay giant of Prague and ask ourselves, are we ready for what we might awaken? The future of AI isn't just about what it can do, but what it should do and who ultimately holds the reins.